Hi everyone, how are you? Thanks for joining me again on GMH English and today I thought I'd give you some vocabulary on the topic of advertising. Advertising seems very ubiquitous and we can't get away from it seemingly. We're always on social media, on looking at a TV screen or a billboard and it's always right there in front of our face. Most of this is just from my observation and my opinion. I didn't take a class in marketing or anything like that. So maybe you have your own suggestions or own words that you'd like to add to this list, but I thought this might be a, a fun lesson with some different vocabulary. So let me know what you think in the comments or by sending an email to contact at gmhenglish.com. As far as I can tell, advertisers want to let you know that you will be getting more of something from their product. More power. More prestige. More time. More respect more sex, more intelligence, more happiness, more energy, more savings, more good looks, more rest, more everything of the things that we want, and of course, less of the things we don't, less harm to animals, less harm on the environment, less carbon emissions, less strain on your back, less strain on your wallet, less damage to your eyes, less pressure, less noise, less paperwork, and even less ads if you sign up for their premium services, for example. They use the most attractive and celebrated people in their commercials. Using humour is a popular technique because wherever you are, in a park, in an airport, sitting on the toilet, you'll associate it with that time you went, ha! <laughs> oh, happy times. They want you to think and feel the best about yourself. So they'll use language that suggests that you, the purchaser, have the unique ability in this moment to seize the opportunity to buy something that best reflects your inherent specialness. Maybe you've never realized it. Maybe it's an ability that's always lain dormant inside of you. But this is your chance to show the world, so don't miss out. That I think is one of the inherent contradictions of advertising. It promotes the ideal that everyone is unique and should embrace and feel empowered by who they really are by encouraging everyone on the planet to buy the exact same piece of plastic that spewed out of their factories. Makes sense, doesn't it? You know, I realize I'm quite amazing now that I have the new Samsung smartphone. I mean, I must be special and unique, right? I mean, it would have done the same for Junior, but he's still a little rat bag. So I think advertising also includes reminders with words like never. Never submit, never quit. Never back down. Never give up. Never follow others. Only your dreams. Oh. They'll use images and adjectives to suggest that their product is your gateway to the things you're guaranteed to want. They'll appeal to your desire for health, freedom, safety, energy with words like fresh, new, innovative, exclusive, and worthy, as in you're worthy. So treat yourself to our state-of-the-art, organic, glossy, animal-friendly, sustainably sourced piece of crap, if you want to stay that way. Guaranteed to be your only path to success and happiness until it breaks down in two and a half months. Conditions may apply. If you like this video, please take this once in a lifetime opportunity to subscribe. I promise that it'll increase your salary, leisure time, spiritual and psychological health, coordination, reaction time, liver function, may also cause dizziness and diarrhea. So, bye beware. Bye for now.